opening ceremony, and it's very distinctive for the nursing community. And it's unlike any other graduation ceremony, and you heard Dr. Niehaus address that. Um, it's the first um, time that you're considered entering the nursing, the graduate enters the nursing community, and it's rich and proud history. So that's what the pin signifies. It dates back to even before Florence Nightingale with that honor and recognition of that. It marks the completion of your coursework, and it honors nursing graduates who work in a career where they will have to be selfless for the good of many others. I would like to invite Amelia Phillips to the stage. Thank you, Dr. Matthews, for that incredible introduction. <laughs> This is nerve-wracking, everyone. <laughs> okay. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to start off by thanking God, as well as every single one of you, who took the time to share one of the most commemorable days of our lives. When I started nursing school, a former graduate from HCC named Stephanie told me that everything that could, get, that could go wrong with your life will go wrong in your life while you're in nursing school. <laughs> but my job was to push through the adversities, and I will tell you she was right. <laughs> in my opinion, the most important and effective way to work through an adversity is by having a good support system. Today, I am able to thank my family, my mother, Wendy, my sisters, and Diana and Dagny, my best friend, Erica, my closest friends, co-workers, colleagues, professors such as Shania Matthews, Lisa Simmons, Teresa Hess, Olivia Menson, Christina Sanchez, and our lab instructors like Diana, Kathy, and Vicky. And last but not least, my classmates. It is an honor for me to know that I'll be sharing the same career as the most valuable, smart, and dedicated individuals I've ever met in my short lifetime. As a new nurse, I just want to be at least half smart as Ty, Danielle, and Jerry. <laughs> Have the leadership skills of Andre, Gladstone, and Dianis. Always remain positive and charismatic as Joey, Maidalena, and Jess have been, and 100% prepare for my patients, like I've learned from Mary, Desiree, and Caitlin. And I always want to be the friend everyone can count on, like Haley, Rosa, Alice, Kendra, Willinika, Elizabeth, and Patricia. Thank you all for teaching me such great values, and I hope I was able to share with you guys the same care, or at least half of it, that you all provided for me. Now that we are sealed off to practice what we all wish for these past two years, remember that you went to nursing school, and there's nothing that can stop you now. Lastly, I have to close this speech by dedicating a few words in Spanish to my family, since they have no clue about anything I said. <laughs> okay. Gracias a mi madre Wendy y a toda mi familia por el esfuerzo que hiciste para venir a este país y sacar nuestra familia adelante. Gracias por priorizar mi futuro y educación antes que tu felicidad y comodidad. Te prometo que este es solo un logro de muchos y tus enseñanzas las llevaré en alto siempre en mi futuro. Y para todos los padres hispanos que han sacrificado todo por sus hijos, espero que sepan que los amamos y apreciamos con todo el corazón. Thank you, everyone. So 
now the part that you are here for, we're going to start the pinning of the graduates. So pinning the Dale Mabry morning students will be Dr. Jocelyn Ritchie and Ms. Elsie Valentin Medina. Uh, calling names will be Dr. Karen Taylor and Ms. Elena Eldridge. So Dale Mabry morning students, you can stand up and come to the stage. And you can move that up too. Oh, it's not like they little to go their name. They'll hand you a card with their name. Okay. Gabriela Garcia. Nicole Baldwin. Madison Robarts. Robarts. Chrissy Trong. Madison Roman. Kenzie Nicoletti. Katarina Pompey. <laughs> Olivia Perez. <laughs> Tanisha Green. <laughs> Brock McCall. <laughs> Yameris Nives. <laughs> Sydney. Brown. Chase Noriega. Aaron Bailey. Isabella Charette. Dashini Singh, <laughs> Joanne Ruth Joseph, <laughs> Christopher Russo, <laughs> Francesca Rivera.
Does Naya groom?
Taylor Locklear. Garcia Reyna. And now we will have cohort four. Dale Mabry Evenings, please rise. For pinning, we're going to have Dr. Sheila Mathias. Also, we're going to have Dr. Sydney Duff for pinning. To the podium will be Miss Amanda Perry, Perry Colleen. Wanda Madden. Jennifer Ray's pinning, um, Dr. Sheila Mathias calling names, and Dr. Laura Lewicki um, calling names. Probably name. Christiana Smiley. All right. 
right, and now we will have the Plant City Mornings. Calling, uh, or pinning is Dr. Shania Matthews and Ms. Lisa Simmons. And calling names are Dr. Michelle Hutcherson and Ms. Danielle King. So Plant City.
Tawana Dennis. Kim Hamilton. Ethan Greer. Samantha Henjun. Cassidy Keebler. Austin Sturgill. So let me be the first to congratulate the May 2024 graduates. celebration, our ceremony, and that's the candle lighting. And so tonight the candles are going to be lit, uh, lit by Diana and Millie. And they're going to light the candles and they'll go down the aisle and light your candles from your lamps and then you'll pass the light. Mm -hmm. So this also helps us to remember that nurses are the light during the darkest times for those that they are caring for. All right, students or graduates, if you'll stand up as you're passing your light. And as we continue to pass the light down your aisles, um, I'm gonna call up um, Tracy Minke. She is going to lead us in the International Nurses Pledge. Um, Tracy is a proud graduate from HCC. And she walked across the stage 40 years ago. Um, she spent her entire career at TGH, and we are very lucky that she's an associate in the nursing lab. Many, many, many of our students. And any of the nurses in uh, the audience, if you want to stand and recite the pledge. I'm very honored, thank you. Is that good? So here we go. In the full knowledge of the obligations I am undertaking, I promise to care for the sick with all the skills and understanding I possess without regard to race, creed, color, politics, or social status, 
sparing no effort to conserve life, to alleviate suffering, and to promote health. I will respect at all times the dignity and religious beliefs of the patients under my care, holding in confidence all personal information entrusted to me and refraining from any action which might endanger life or health. I will endeavor to keep my professional knowledge and skill at the highest level and to give loyal support and cooperation to all members of the health team. I will do my utmost to honor the International Code of Ethics applied to nursing and to uphold the integrity of the nurse. All right, excellent. So again, I want to introduce you to our future nurses, our graduates. Well, welcome to nursing. accomplishment and we always love celebrating your success uh, as you look forward to the future remember that your journey is not over but just beginning because there's that little thing called the end flags just waiting for you so know you can step forward in confidence and you have a firm foundation as you move uh, forward and that you're not alone look around you at your peers and your faculty we are all nurses you came here today as student nurse and you're leaving here a colleague. We wish you the very best in all your future endeav endeavors. So guests, we're gonna start a recessional back, so we ask you to remain at, at your spots, because uh, I know you wanna stand and cheer for your, um, your people. So I would like you to remain, we're gonna recess out. It'll start with the administrators, they'll lead the recession, recessional followed by the faculty and followed by the students and we encourage you to meet your graduate outside. 